out now! I already gave you three months! I'm leaving, sir. Take my advice and get a real job, kid. That guitar isn't gonna take you anywhere. Jesse. Hey, Molly. Hey. Oh, what? Jesse, I. Oh, I am so sorry. What? I'm shocked I didn't get kicked out earlier. I mean, I haven't been able to pay the rent in months. Jesse, you should have told me. I could have helped you. That's the thing, Molly. You're always helping me. I... You've been there for me during my toughest times, especially when my parents died last year. Yeah, well, that's what friends do for each other. I just feel like our friendship is so one-sided. It's always me throwing my problems onto you. And at this point, at this point, I, I feel like I'm a dark cloud constantly raining over your head. It's time that I face my problems on my own for once. Jesse, I... I have to, Molly. Okay, so what are you gonna do? The 212 bus leaves in about 30 minutes. Oh, okay, so you're just gonna take a bus and, and then what? I don't know. See where it takes me? Oh, no, it's gonna take you to a place where you know absolutely no one and no one is gonna help you and you're going to wind up living on the streets. Very possible. Jesse, okay, just move in with me, at least until you get back up onto your feet, okay? Even if I did that, Cal would not be happy. Okay, don't worry about Cal. Cal is my boyfriend. And he's just gonna have to understand that my friend needs me. So come on, get your stuff, we're going. I'm, I'm seriously not trying to put that strain on your relationship. Okay, I'm not taking note for an answer. So come on, let's go inside. We're going inside, let's go. All right, if you need more blankets or pillows, it's over in the closet. Thank you so much, Molly. I honestly don't know how I'm ever gonna repay you. Well, just pay me back when you're a famous musician, Jimi Hendrix. What the? What is he doing here? What is Jesse doing on your couch? Huh? Why is Jesse on your couch? Hey, Cal, first off, you need to calm down. How am I supposed to be calm? How would you feel if you found some random person sleeping on my couch? No, Jesse's not a stranger. Yeah, and that's why this is even worse. He had nowhere to go. His his landlord evicted him. As he should have. Look, Jesse is just a lowlife. Last year, all you did was spend time with him when his stupid parents died. And now this? He has no future. And what's crazy is, you're still into him. We've had this conversation already, okay? I love Jesse. But not like in a romantic kind of way. Don't get this twisted. No, 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 no. I'm not crazy. It's obvious that you like him! Cow! You're my boyfriend and I love you, okay? I mean, Jesse and I are just friends. We don't have feelings for each other like that. Okay, if he's just your friend, you're gonna have to choose me over him. You're giving me an ultimatum? No, I'm not gonna do that. Fine. Looks like you made your choice already. We're over. Well, Cal, wait! Looks like you finally got what you wanted, Jesse. Cal, you want, stop! Cal. Molly? 
Molly, are you okay? You just broke up with me. Molly, I'm so sorry. I'm leaving. Cal, don't take anything out on Molly. I forced her to let me stay here. No, you didn't. Don't cover for your friend. She begged you to stay. She's always missing you. And you two could live your happy little lives together under one roof. And you know what? Don't sleep out here. Go sleep in the room next to her. Cal, stop! Just knock it off, okay? Please! Cal. You still play this little thing, Jesse? How cute. I wonder how your parents feel knowing their son is a waste of life. Or maybe the stress of having you in their life is what got them killed. What did you just say? Hey! What did you just say? Stop, Jesse! This isn't worth your energy. And you just get out of my house. Just leave. Despite the breakup, Molly supports Jesse and pushes him to submit his music to record labels. Unfortunately, things don't get easy. Jesse starts receiving rejection letter after rejection letter, and to make things worse, Jesse discovers that Molly is behind on her bills. Then, he decides he must give up his dream to help the one person who's always been by his side. Hey there. You must be Jesse. Whoa, it looks even better in person. Yeah. This has been my baby for the last four years. You said $5,000, right? Mm-hmm. Well, I'll go ahead and write the check for it. Jesse, what are you doing? I'm paying you back for all the help you've given me. <laughs> no, he's not selling. I'll let you guys discuss it for a little bit. Uh, I'll be right here in the front. Jesse, don't give up on your dreams. <sighs> Nothing worth having is easy. And I know that you may feel like your music career is going nowhere right now, but all it takes is just one record label to take a chance on you. You have so much talent and it'd be sad to see it go to waste. Molly, I've tried. I've tried everything. Maybe it's just not in the cards for me. No, there's always a way to keep trying. Look, there's a record label out there somewhere that's just dying to give you a chance. You just have to find them. I don't mean to eavesdrop or anything, but did you mention a record label? I, I, I was. Yes, he is looking for a record deal. Can you play me a few chords real quick? Sure. It's actually really good. I know. And you said you had a demo too, right? Can I hear it? Of course, yeah. There you go. <laughs> this is really good. Thank you. Wow, this slaps. Appreciate it. There, thank you. You're really talented. Thank you. I'm gonna go ahead and write the check. Jesse, right. don't let this happen. This, this is your dream of a career, How else okay? am I supposed to pay it back? There's no you way. You don't need to. You just need to keep doing this, okay? Molly, you've been struggling with feeding the bills. I... Uh, there must be a mistake. I, I asked for five grand. This check says 20K. Well, I'm actually not interested in the guitar anymore. I'm interested in signing you to my record label, Illumably Records. <laughs> what? <laughs> no what? way! This is amazing. <laughs> You're super talented and we'd love to have you as a part of our label. Of, of course. Thank you so much. No worries. <laughs> Thank you. 
Well, whenever you have a decision, you have my number, so I'll be back in the office. Hit me up when you're ready. You'll hear from me. Awesome. Take care, guys. I almost gave up on my dream. See, I told you, nothing worth having is easy. You're the best friend anybody could ever ask for. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. This check is for you. It's for all the help and for all the support you've given me these last few months. No, Jesse, I can't take that. I'm not taking no for an answer. Okay, come here. <laughs> come on. You better call him right now! <laughs> Congratulations! Come on, let's go celebrate! Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. No, Mr. Big Spender. A year passes, and Jesse releases his first album with Illumably Records. It's an instant success, and Jesse's album is number one on the Billboard Top 100. Even people who don't like Jesse can't help but love his music. Wow, can't believe he actually made it. Hey Illumably fam, thank you for watching that video. At Illumably, our mission is to bring light back into the world. And with you, there, there is, is nothing, nothing we, we can, can do. do. Thank you for watching everyone. And, and I'll we'll see you guys in the next video. Wait, I was supposed to say that. Oops. See you next time.